Welcome to the 5-Minute Success Blueprint, an inspirational destination where it is our mission to motivate, educate, and provide success tools for life, home, and business. It is our desire that these wisdom nuggets will take you from where you are now to where you ought to be. Here is your host, best-selling author, African Oscar-winning screenwriter, filmmaker, behavioral health and transformation interventionist, your vision midwife, the princess of suburbia, a sentimental nurse practitioner, Dr. Princess Pumi Hancock. Hello everyone. Yes, this is your princess in suburbia. This is Dr. Princess Fumi Hancock saying hello, hello, hello from Nashville, Tennessee, United States of America. Well, what do I want to talk about today? Do yourself a favor. Do yourself a favor. Um, I was just thinking here and uh, this is in regard to myself anyway, because as you all know, I always like to take examples from my own life because I think that's more proper. Uh, and that's something that it's more inspiring. And so I was thinking about a particular situation in my life where I am trying to really get through to a particular person and it don't become frustrating. It becomes, um, because I felt like that person was not hearing me. I felt like even though I was trying to say exactly how I feel, that person was underestimating what I was feeling. And so that brought a little bit of frustration um, into my life. Uh, likewise, there are certain things in our lives so that you, we want to be a singer, we want to be a writer, we want to be a public speaker, we want to be a doctor, whatever it is that we desire in our hearts. And so we keep pushing and we keep thinking that we're doing everything that we're supposed to be doing, or at least we believe that we're doing what we're supposed to be doing, and we just keep pushing. Here is my wisdom nugget for you today. Do yourself a favor, quit fighting quit fighting. A lot of times we are pushing against the winds. We are trying to make things that are not meant to happen in that season in our lives. Uh, we need to quit fighting. Uh, preparation takes time and discipline. And when you fight through the preparation time, refusing to embrace it wholeheartedly, you only extend the time. Let me say that again. When you, when you, when you, when you, when you fight through the preparation time, Refusing to embrace it wholeheartedly, you only extend the time that that thing is supposed to manifest in your life. So a lot of times we are fighting because uh, certain things are coming our way that are not in the package that we expect. Uh, they're not looking the way that we want them to look or certain opportunities are coming, but yet they don't look like what you really desire. God knows the season and the time for whatever it is that you desire in your heart. And of course, we also have to be prepared for it. When you go into the Bible and you look at Joseph, I mean, Joseph was prepared for that role that he ended up having. He ended up being the second-hand man and the most powerful, uh, the powerful, most powerful man in, in the world uh, back then. And so preparation is essential. A lot of us are in the preparation mode, and because of that, we're a little bit frustrated because we're fighting through the through the preparation. We don't want to uh, extend that preparation, but yet we are fighting. We're asking God, take me and remove this situation. Uh, whereas God is saying, "Hold your peace, be still, and I will take you and walk you through that storm." I will walk you through the preparation time. I will walk you through the storm. I will walk you through it, not over it, not around it, but I will walk you through it. So many of us right now, I will tell you right now, quit fighting. Just let the process begin. Let the, let the preparation time begin. Uh, if you have somebody that has disappointed you right now and you're so distraught about it, it is preparation time for a greater thing. If you were wanting a particular job and you applied for it, you knew that you were meant to have it and yet it did not happen, there is a preparation time for it. Uh, if you desire to be the world, uh, the most well-known singer and yet everything you do seems like it's taking you the opposite way, guess what? You are in your preparation time. So quit fighting your preparation time. Give in to it and begin to ask God on a daily basis, what am I supposed to learn in this season? Until next time, be inspired, be motivated, be of sentimental value, and above all, be authentic in all you do. Please do not forget my blog. Log on to my blog, yourinneryou.com. Your of course, you can also um, listen to this podcast. Bye for now.
Thank you for joining us on the 5-Minute Success Blueprint, where we encourage you to live life full and leave it empty. With your host, Dr. Princess Fumi Hancock, a nurse practitioner turned filmmaker, behavioral health and transformation interventionist, and a life coach mentor to many across the globe. Desiring to make a change in one's life is just half the battle. Taking deliberate strides to change one's situation will ultimately yield great results. We hope that you have gained some valuable lessons on today's show. Please join us next time when we bring you another exciting episode of the 5-Minute Success Blueprint. Until next time, live life with intent.